bushes have been growing for about two weeks, and this is how big they become. I'm actually absolutely thrilled. What we have is beyond what uh, our wildest dreams could have imagined. Oh my God, look at these, they're babies. Okay. Our whole goal was to get kids, um, you know, just some, some experiential learning, some hands-on learning outdoors. How do you think it's going to change? Because it's going to grow, yeah. and I think it's going to be six centimeters high. That's my prediction. Nice. I love that you're making a prediction. Those are great science words. Amber Keller is a master gardener um, and also an educator, and I am a former teacher, and together we sort of banded together and um, decided that we were going to, you know, try and, and build a school garden. Fantastic parent volunteers that come out here daily to open up the school garden to students during their recess time. Come with such enthusiasm to help in any way they can. Um, whether it's watering the plants or looking for plants to harvest. They also love to make observations. You can rub lemon thyme in your fingers and then you can smell and then it smells really good. Very much student-led. So they wanted to see a butterfly habitat and they wanted to see wildflowers, an outdoor classroom element, a hummingbird feeder, um, a weather station. Usually you don't really see these a lot out in public. <laughs> so if we didn't have the garden, we would not have these problems. As we're working together in the garden, they've been sharing um, very personal things about, you know, thanking us for having the garden. Opportunities for students who may want to connect with other children and find friends. And they say things like, oh, Mrs. Schaefer, or Mrs. Keller, or Mrs. Nichol, thank you so much for having a garden for me to go to because I haven't made a friend yet. Or I, I'm new to the school and I, I, I'm very shy. And for us, I mean, we cry in the tool shed about this. It's just, it's overwhelming and heartwarming. And so we're so happy to have a garden for them to go to.